I'll get into the B stuff now. Curly, if you still here, if you still watching this video, I personally challenge you to do 30 sprays of these. I don't think you doing 30 sprays of these next fragrances. There's just no way, no how. Yo, what up, what up, it's the kid CJ City, so we back with a brand new video. Today, we are going to be talking about you sissy spraying mother. <laughs> Not just playing, man. Salute to Curly Fragrance, man. She out here calling y'all sissy sprayers and stuff like that. Stirring the pot, causing a little controversy. You know, if you out here, you like, oh man, what you talking about? You getting all these compliments? I don't get no compliments when I wear that fragrance. Hey, maybe I need to boost up the, the sprays a little bit and maybe she has something. Maybe you need to stop being a little sissy sprayer, okay? Maybe you do need to amp it up just a little bit, okay? I previously did a video telling you guys how where to to spray your fragrances in that video I told you guys there was a certain fragrance that I spray 17 times and people were looking at me like I'm crazy all right so I will go ahead and I will vouch for her and I will say that you know 17 sprays is not over spraying I feel like a lot of people they're they're walking too timid man they're too scared to offend people I don't want to you know uh, offend anybody you know I don't want to over spray nah man if you ain't getting them compliments if you want to get some attention then go ahead and over spray I would honestly See, keep spraying until somebody tells you hey man you got on too much cologne then you can dial it back a little bit at least you're getting some attention all right so i got some fragrances here that i'm going to be breaking down my spray routine and i'm going to be letting you guys know these are high count sprays when it comes to these fragrances right here and i'm going to be letting you you guys know like i said i did a video go check that video out i break down how you can spray your fragrances you know i'm going to spare you all the details in this just to save time but basically in a nutshell I was telling you, if you feel like you have a light performing fragrances, then you spray it X amount of times. If you feel like you have a good performing fragrance, you spray it this amount of times. If you feel like you have a great performing fragrance, you spray it this amount of times. And if you have a beast mode fragrance, then you spray it this amount of times. If you stay in the confines of that, you'll always know how to spray your fragrances, okay? But nonetheless, these are some high count sprays that I'm going to be doing and I'm going to be showing you guys, man. You know, Curly Fragrance, she knows what she's talking about. So I'm going to be telling you, these are fragrances that I spray about, you know, anywhere from 10, to 17 times all right and i'll show you a 17 sprayer for me is going to you know be this fragrance right here this is going to be dolce gabbana the one you know a lot of people say that the performance is lackluster in here this performance is crap and all this other stuff like that honestly I feel like you probably just need to boost up the sprays. I'm doing 17 sprays with this fragrance, and I'll go ahead and I'll show you how you can do 17 sprays with this fragrance, all right? I actually don't want to wear this, so I'm just going to, you know, pretend. But anyway, this is how I do my 17 spray routine. You got to distribute this thing evenly throughout the body. You don't want to just go 17 sprays all crazy, you know, spraying all willy-nilly up there. You don't want to do that, all right? Be very strategic with your sprays and your placements, okay? So this is how we go 17 sprays. I'll go one on the side of the neck, right? So one, I'll go two, I'll go three, I'll go four, and I'll go five on the back of the ears, okay? I'll go six right here in the front of the neck. So that's six sprays off top. The majority of my fragrances, I do that. That's six sprays automatically off top I'm doing right there, okay? I'll go ahead, I'll hit myself on the back of the hand right here. I'll do seven, I'll do eight, and then I like to spray my forearms right here. So I'll do nine and I'll do 10 right there. So that's 10 right there already, okay? I'm hitting my clothes as well. I don't care what you guys are talking about. I hit my clothes. I want my stuff to last, all right? So we'll go 10 and we'll go 11. We'll go 12 and then I'll go ahead and I'll go 13 right there, okay? We'll stop. I kind of just use that as like a little primer or whatever the case is. I let that thing dry down just a little bit right there, all right? And then we'll go ahead and we'll pick it up and we'll do some more sprays right before we head out the door. So we left off on 13. I'll go ahead, I'll go, you know, 14, I'll go 15, I'll go 16, and then I'll go 17. That's what I'm doing with this right here, okay? I'm telling you, another fragrance that I do a lot of sprays with, Aventus Cologne. A lot of people say the performance on here is bad. You know, it, it kind of withers away after a while. <laughs> you need to boost up the spray count, okay? I'm doing, you know, about 15 sprays with this thing right here, okay? So I do the same thing. I'll do my routine. I'll go one, I'll go two, I'll go three, I'll go four, I'll go five, I'll go six. Six off top, I'm going six up here, okay? Seven, eight, nine, 10, I'm going 10, I'm hitting my clothes, I'll go 11, I'll go 12, I'll go 13 right there. That's basically what I'll do with this one right here, okay? And honestly, 
I actually got a comment with this fragrance. I was wearing it and it was probably like about four or five hours later. Somebody had made a joke when I went into the office. They was like, hey, CJ, man, I think you spilled something on your shirt, man. And I'm like, yo, what, what you talking about? What I spilled? They like, uh, I think you spilled some cologne or something like that, man. That stuff is strong. They told me that when I was wearing this fragrance. So a lot of people complain about how they get lackluster performance with this fragrance. And here I am. People telling me I spray too much or I smell like I got too much on with the same fragrance. I'm just boosting up the spray count, okay? So that's basically what I'll do with that. You know, one of my favorite fragrances right here, Tom Ford Noir Extreme. A lot of people say it's a good fragrance. They just, it don't last long for them. For me, it lasts a good amount of time. Maybe because I'm doing about 13 sprays with this thing right here, okay? Same thing, I'm doing six off top. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm a six sprayer up here all the time, you know, with fragrances that I really enjoy. So again, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six off top. I'll go ahead and hit myself right here. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Again, uh, I'll spray my clothes, 11, 12, 13. And that is basically the standard when it comes to like the majority of my fragrances that I really like, okay? So I'll, that's a 13 sprayer for me right here, okay? A fragrance that I enjoy a lot. Side effect right here. This one right here, this is strong stuff, okay? So you could do 13, you could do 17 if you want to, but you're definitely gonna choke people out, okay? So this one right here, where I feel like a lot of people might play it safe, they might do about four sprays with this thing right here. Uh-uh, I'm doing about eight sprays with this thing. I'm telling you, and I get some good compliments. So of course, I'm hitting myself six up top. I'm going one, I'm going two, I'm going three, I'm going four. I'm going five and I'm going six on the back of the ears. And then I'll just go ahead and I'll hit myself right here on the forearms, bang right there. And then I'll go right there, okay? So I'll hit myself with eight. If I got on long sleeves, I'm still hitting myself right here on the forearms. I'll just hit it on top of my clothing. I'm not sacrificing any sprays just because I got a long sleeve shirt on, okay? So this one, I'm doing about eight sprays with this. It's, it's a nice, you know, good performing fragrance but I'll still boost it up just a little bit so people can smell me. Now, I'll get into the beast stuff now. Curly, if you still here, if you still watching this video, I personally challenge you to do 30 sprays of these. I don't think you doing 30 sprays of these next fragrances. There's just no way, no how. However, you know, I feel like sometimes with these fragrances, if you want to stand out, you might want to do one extra spray, okay? So, a fragrance that I'm talking about, BDK Tobacco Rose. Room filler, gonna fill up a room, no way, no how am I doing 17 sprays, 13 sprays with this thing. I'm not even going eight sprays. I'm gonna do about three sprays. But if you, if you guys are struggling to get those compliments and you guys want a little bit more attention, you can go for four sprays, five sprays, you're gonna fill up an entire room, okay? So this is basically what I do with uh, fragrances that I feel like just are beast. These, I'm telling you, these are beasts. You literally can do one spray and you'd be good, but I'm doing about three, okay? So I hit myself on the side of the neck, one, two. Now, when these beast mode fragrances, the spray is key here, okay? You can't be going out there, man, shooting the ball, you're bricking it, you're, you're smacking the backboard. Nah, we need a swish here, okay, man? So you need to spray right there on the neck and it needs to go smack dab right here. You can't be spraying in the mist, just fly over there, man. You, you're doing it all wrong. You gotta nail the spray here, okay? One, two, that's just standard. If you, if you feel like you have a cloying fragrance, you could just hit yourself on the back of the neck right there, you know, and you'll be good. But if you really enjoy the smell of this fragrance, then you can just go ahead and substitute that back spray and do it right here because it's gonna push up into your nostrils and you'll enjoy the fragrance a little bit more, okay? Now, like I said, if you wanna just go for one extra push, then you can do both, okay? One, two, three, four. Those are beast mode, you know, uh, performing fragrances. Four sprays on a Beast mode performing fragrance is a lot, but I'm telling you, we don't want to be sissy sprayers, okay? So go ahead and do about four sprays on something that's beast mode, all right? Now, another fragrance that's beast mode for me, Rainier Oud Rain. This one right here, it's just a mango bomb. It's a fruit bomb. This actually has a little woody nature, a little oud to it as well, but I'm telling you, this can easily be a one sprayer. You know, sometimes if I'm just working in the office, I'm just chilling to myself, and I just kind of want to get the scent profile, I'll just do one spray. It's going to last me all day, I'm telling you. So to do four sprays, you're literally over spraying here, but it's okay because we want to project. We want to get those compliments. We want to get noticed, all right? So do about four sprays. You could do the same routine that I was telling you, man. One, two, 
three, you'll be good. One, two, three, that's for your own personal enjoyment. Or if you just want to get a lot of attention, one, two, three, four. Bang, bang, you good, all right? So the next fragrance, the last fragrance that I got on this list right here, you know, this is Swiss, Swiss Arabian Shag Off Oud, okay? Beast stuff. This thing is going to fill up a room with about two sprays. But we don't want to be sissy sprayers. We want to get some attention. We want to get some compliments. So we're going to go for four sprays, all right? Same thing. One, two, three, four, all right? Or if this thing gets on your nerves, you can go one, two, three, all right? If, you know, you just really, really want to work a room, you really, really just want to overspray, you want to grab everybody's attention, then I still think you should do, you know, your four sprays. But just kind of put it in the back, all right? So you could just go one, two, three three, four in the back of your ears, all right? And that's basically how you work these fragrances, man. This is how you go out there and you get those compliments, man. This is how you boost up, you know, those spray counts and you don't have to like just go willy nilly in one spot. You can, you know, distribute it throughout your body, have a lot of sprays, project to a lot of people and I'm telling you, it's just going to work. So that's my opinion on being a sissy sprayer or over spraying or whatever the case is. Yes, it is needed in some cases. However, 30 sprays is a bit much. I'll be honest with you. I would love to see, you know, Curly Fragrance do her spray routine about a 30 spray fragrance. That's crazy, all right? But anyway, that's basically all I got for you. You guys already know what it is. CJ City TV. I'm signing out until next time. I appreciate all the love. Peace.